What is up, you guys? It is your boy, freaking retarded goose. How are you guys doing? Welcome to a Call of Duty video. So, um, these are probably gonna be most of my videos. This and, um, Just Cause 3. Mostly because these are easier to set up and make. And like Just Cause 3, where I have to like explore the world and stuff. But, yeah. So basically, I'm just doing some clips. Oh, I hope you guys enjoy. Oh my Jesus, freaking Christ! Please, somebody shot my foot off and call me butter. <laughs> oh my God. <clears throat> oh, but uh, this um, lobby is really annoying. Oh my God! Die, die! Oh, I got, oh, I got an assist! Yay! Yay! Kill me. No, but what I wanted to talk about, holy Jesus, frick. Somebody, let What I want to talk about was, um, the next Call of Duty, what's gonna happen with it. Okay. Basically, um, I will be covering it. I'm getting the special edition, so I have all the DLC, don't worry. I'll be covering zombies, I'll be playing every single map. I'll be hopefully playing every single, um, DLC multiplayer map. And, um, I will cover the beta too, which I think is either in September. Yeah, it's, I, it starts in September, I think ends in October. So I will be covering for that. Uh. Yeah, as I was saying, now, Call of Duty World War II it's gonna be a much different game. We haven't had a game like this since Call of Duty 3. Yeah, I'm not even kidding. Like, they won't, like, there's so many different things, like, you can't create a class anymore. You, um, can't, rege you can't regenerate health. It's gonna be just like the older Call of Duties, but new, you know what I mean? And what, how this, why this will be hard for me and a lot of other people, is we haven't had a game like this, as I said, all the way back to Call of Duty 3. And a lot of people haven't, haven't even been around that long. Like, I've only been here since Modern Warfare 3. And, um, the point is, and it has, it's been like three or four years since we've had a Boots on the Ground game, either. So this is gonna be brand new. I mean, some people have some experience if they play the beta like me. I don't know how much experience that would give us. But as I said before, brand kind of a new phone back. This is gonna be kind of new for us. It's just gonna be like a brand new thing all over. It. Started over. Um, a lot of people said, "Oh my gosh, they're just oh they made this because they're reacting to Battlefield, the success for Battlefield." Actually, they had no idea Battlefield was gonna have the success because every single game company creates their game three years in advance. Yeah, I know, right? A glitchy freaking game like this, three it takes three years. Well, it's mostly Activision, but I just wanted to talk about that. And the zomb well, the zombies are a really different story because they do it maybe two, only one year into, like two years in development, they start making zombies. Cause you know, but zombies, I've seen the trailer. Um, oh my Jesus Christ, it looked terrifying. Like, and it's supposed to be in third person, and nobody still knows this yet. But from what we can see, the trailer it kind of does look like it has a third person point of view, which um, I'm excited for as long as we can go back and forth. I mean, if you can't, you know, it's okay. Still suck. But we have brand new stories. Matter of fact, um, one of the voice actors is actually one of my favorite act actor, British actors, uh, David Tennant. Um, you can't really see him in anything else except for the um, Comic Con interview, but um, I think he's perfect for a Call of Duty Zombies. Oh my god, oh my god, yes! Yes! No, but I think he's perfect for Call of Duty Zombies. He does great work. He hasn't had any big work like this in forever. And, um, another thing is, I feel like um, 2017 is just the year of sequels. And kind of going back to the roots of the game. Kind of going back to the roots. 
Like, and for me, I am going back to the roots. Like, I'm starting to watch and play more stuff. Like, Doctor Who, um, I haven't watched it in forever, but with the new season coming out with the main, with the main character, or the next Doctor, the 13th Doctor, Be being a I'll woman, which a lot of people are like, eh, but I'm like, okay, I like this twist. Third thing is, um, Call of Duty World War II will, um, be, like, it'll be, it'll fit with the 2017 feel, which you guys do not know that means. It will have, you can play as a girl. Now, from what I saw in the Comic-Con interview for Zombies, there's two guys and two women, or girls, whatever you want to call them. And so, is there going to be two male and two female characters? I don't know. Most likely, just get an even feel of 2017. Now, a lot of people say, oh my god, you can't add girls, it's not historically correct, or some crap like that. And, well, they can't really do historically correct, you know what I mean? Like, they, if they did historically correct, the game would be shame. Like, it would have so much stuff that, w that would be bad, like... Um, certain language or certain people like the girls would see any woman as a main character or any woman as a multiplayer chief. So they're kind of putting a 2017 kind of thing, so it's equal, you know what I mean? And I mean, I don't mind that. It's just, it's a change. And as I said, it's not like 100% going back to its roots, but they're, they, it's going back to its roots, but they are changing some things, which. You know, it's... Now, what happened... What... Why did they probably make a World War II? First of all, is because in Advanced Warfare, they wanted to make a Vietnam kind of thing, right? But Activision was like, no, we gotta do futuristic to prepare time fall and stuff. And with the downfall of Advanced Warfare, they were like, you know what? We'll give two more years of advanced movement, then 2017... We'll give you guys World War II. And, well, they legit with the um, success of Battlefield, they got it. Oh my freaking god! They got it exactly right. Which I really like and was really lucky for them. Which I think Call of Duty probably, in a couple more years, if they kept doing advanced movement, they might have gone bankrupt at this point. They're still doing supply drops, so you know. Well, no thank you. UAV. So, um, I'll get my very first G try and default. I'm gonna get the packets, then the tin. But I'll probably do a face reveal and a G fuel review kind of thing. Same yeah, thing. Um, still working on my hair and stuff for my face reveal. And, um, at this point, you know, I'm like, you're probably, I'm a guy, you gotta wait. It's point my face. Like, I'm on Instagram, I'm on Twitter, I was on Facebook, I'm on, I was on Snapchat. I have another YouTube channel where I show my face. Like, at this point, you guys haven't seen it. I don't know how. Like, I'm out there. Like, on social media, I'll point out my channels, or on my YouTube channel, I'll point out my social media. Like, at this point, I don't know how any of you haven't found. Like, a matter of fact, I'll even point out to my social media channel, my other channel on this one. So I don't know how the frick you guys haven't found my face yet. But, you know, might as well do a freaking face review for 1,000k, or 1k subs. I said 1,000k, Jesus freaking Christ. You know what I mean. But 1k, um, which I'm still very grateful for. I don't know how to predict me what reach 1k that fast. But apparently guys really like videos of me. <laughs> yeah, sure, we all hate you. Go kill yourself, you freaking scrub. Oh my god, I hate this lobby. It's just full of freaking fast moving melee people, persons. Oh my Jesus. Mission clock running down. Oh! Mission clock running freaking down. Great. Kill me. No, but as I said, I'm probably doing a G Fuel review. I'm actually ordering that today. Or the packets first. I might get the shaker today, either or later this week when I get the uh, tin. Don't know. Or if you guys like the video and want more, remember to leave a like. Let's see if we can hit four likes.